What's up, Belder BB? Good morning, Rachel Smith. Thank you for joining me in Dallas, Texas on the Belder BB Show. I really appreciate it. Oh, I'm pumped to be on your show this morning. Thanks for having us. Well, thanks so much. I want to let my audience know that if you're just fascinated by the red carpet, the movies, the fashion, the look, well, Rachel Smith is your go-to entertainment maven. Oh, maven. yes. <laughs> oh, yeah. They told me you were the best of the best, and you now... You're on the red carpet in a weekly half-hour entertainment news show. You are absolutely right, Valder BB. Um, that's exactly what On the Red Carpet's bring into our viewers now, coast to coast. We are rolling out that red carpet. We are going wall to wall with it. We are going to make that red carpet as vibrant as possible. Um, it's so exciting for us because the show's been around since March of 2010. I've been hanging with the show since its inception. We first debuted on... The biggest night in Hollywood, how about the Oscars? So that was our kind of launching pad. And our show was airing to our Los Angeles viewers. From there, it, it snowballed into something bigger. And uh, we were then in like eight markets or so. And now we're going to be in 169 markets starting this weekend. And we could not be happier to be rolling out all the fun, upbeat entertainment news that we are going to be delivering to our viewers. So get ready. Put your hard hat on. Get ready to roll out that red carpet with us because it's going to be a really fun, exciting ride. Okay, so on the red carpet, it covers... Uh, the major red carpet events, or well, tell me, tell me, yeah. what do you cover? Okay, so we, it's kind of a play on words on the red carpet. Of course, there are a lot of red carpets here in Hollywood, and red carpets are found at premieres, you know, like movie premieres and stuff like that. So uh, this week we're on the red carpet for Insidious too, and other movies as well. But um, so that's kind of a play on words. We like to call it OTRC for short because it kind of can be a mouthful after a while. But on the red carpet, we go beyond the red carpet as well. So so, for instance, we could go to, we could go behind the scenes of ABC Scandal and I actually taped a little spot for them recently, like I'll be on the show, but we also take our viewers behind the scenes of the set as well. So that's something that you have to look forward to. We just had a team return from the Toronto International Film Festival, so we're chatting with stars there at the festival, which is kind of like a, what it is a precursor to the Oscars and kind of like kicks off the, uh, the award season craziness. So we're chatting with stars there. I just got back from New York City for Mercedes-Benz Fashion Week. So cool, basically getting the know and giving our viewers the know of all the trends coming up for 2014 and chatting behind the scenes like in some designer studios and backstage, you know, behind the runways and stuff. So giving them a, glitz, or a glimpse into high fashion and how we can incorporate it into our own lifestyle. So we really do, our coverage is entertainment news. It's not just news that happens on the red carpet. Well, you make it all sound red carpet. And oh, that's girl, it, so is, it is all with. fun and fabulous. So How do I, you prepare for these red carpets? And I'd like to know as, you know, the hosting of this, and you've got all these different people, that means you've got to know a lot. It, yeah, you do. I have to know a lot up here. So uh, I, what I do is I, it's not just hanging out on a pretty set and reading a teleprompter and just kind of regurgitating words to our viewers. We are, and I'm far more involved than just with, in that capacity. Every day it's just kind of keeping in touch and seeing what's in the headlines, who's making the headlines, casting news, who's having a baby, who's getting married, that kind of thing. Um, and also, you know, just so, I, so I'm up to speed on that kind of news. In addition to whenever you go to a red carpet premiere, sometimes they'll provide you a list with the names of the guests. Sometimes they won't. So, for instance, if I were going to a premiere party for Modern Family's upcoming season, just for example. Um, it's probably a given that the cast will be there, but perhaps their spouses are there, or maybe a, a celebrity fan is there. So I really have to kind of, you kind of have to know a little bit of everything. And you never, anything's fair game, anything can happen. And so you, you got to be on your toes on those red carpets. That but was it's, my it's next question. really practice. exciting stuff. <laughs> the red carpet, everybody's a free to ask controversial questions to individuals. Now they'll all ask, you know, what do you think about Siri or something like that. But, but you know what, those, we do cover topical uh, current event type questions on the red carpet, but the platform and the tone of our show is really upbeat, positive. We're not trying to rake anyone over the coals. We're not trying to embarrass anyone. We really want to showcase and highlight, yes, bring you those newsworthy 
tidbits and stuff about maybe a celebrity, but we're here to highlight and really praise and celebrate entertainment news and pop culture news. So that's, that's also something that differentiates on the red carpet from other entertainment shows that are out there right now is every week, half an hour a week, we're going to give you some fun, upbeat news that you need to know. We're going to create some really exciting moments with stars on the red carpet and out on sets or behind the scenes and things like that. So that's what on the red carpet is going to give viewers that they can't get anywhere else. And we're going we're gonna to take them on location to different places, whether it's here in Hollywood at an iconic landmark spot like the Hollywood sign. We, we will get up close and personal to that Hollywood sign. We're going to touch it for the viewers so they feel like they're right there with us hiking down the Hollywood Hill. But then we could also go to Australia, or we could go to London, or we could go to the Toronto International Film Festival. So the opportunities are truly endless and really span beyond that pretty well, red carpet. <laughs> well, this is going to this is going to be hot and unique, and of yes. course, nobody else has Rachel Smith, so it's going to be wonderful. Thank you. And you know, of course, like we always, to our our OTRC family wants to continue the conversation with our fans, be it on Twitter or Facebook or Instagram, and we are just so excited for the opportunity, thanks to our local viewers in Los Angeles, to really have the chance to roll out this red carpet and excite the rest of the country about pop culture and entertainment news. So we really look forward to expanding our audience and, and really having everyone welcome us into our home, hopefully. So it's exciting Well, when can we our watch show. our first installment of On the Red Carpet? First installment wanna... of On the Red Carpet airs this weekend. And depending upon the market, since we are in 169 markets now, oh my gosh, that's so crazy to say. But uh, basically, it, the time changes dep depending upon the market that it's being aired. And so you can go to OT trc.com, on the red carpet.com, click on the where to watch tab, and there we give a listing of the markets that we are airing in, the times, or you can check your local listings for that as well. Well, Rachel Smith, I can't wait because Aww. I know you are going to be the hostess with the most. Oh, and you I got it, girl. Wait. I'm so excited too. So thank you so much for having that enthusiasm for our show, and, and we really do share that same energy and really are looking forward to this new platform. Thank you so much, Rachel Smith. As they say, you're the entertainment maven. Thank okay. you very much for being on the Belder <laughs> BB Show. Thank you for having us. And good luck. Thank you.